maybe even back. But yet they're chatting along with us. So it's confusing, you know what I mean? Well, I do, do kidnapped her, locked her on the, no, on the balcony. You're not going to go on there. Come on. Search that. Robbery. Oh boy, we got a bank robbery going at Citibank. It covers the uh, office, they said. Holy shit. Let's get it. Love bank robberies. <laughs> No, who owns this bank? Oh, he's in his Tesla, slumped over the wheel in the fucking El Pollo Loco parking lot or drive through. Things get crazy. But hey, you need El Pollo Loco. Oh, it's getting crazy, Elon. Elon slumped over the wheel right now. We're not going to try to go get some drunk chicken. <laughs> Let me get to that drunk chicken set. Oh, boy. <laughs> no, it wasn't. The chicken, he ain't got the chicken yet. So either they took way too long and he just like fell asleep. But I doubt it's that. I'm thinking he's intoxicated and, and incapacitated. And that's why he's sitting there passed out behind the wheel of his Tesla. Or maybe the Tesla has been in autopilot the whole time and it decided it wanted chicken <laughs> from El Pollo Loco. It's like, fuck, this fool's passed out. Let's go get us some chicken. This fool won't even recognize. We'll just wake up in his driveway. Oh, we're here. Oh, boy, I didn't even see that. Northeast unit battery just occurred at 1000 Ben Scully Avenue. Seed and victim standing by. Question C, Dodger Security standing by with the victim and suspect in parking lot number three. It's code 2241 RD1195. Someone got hit with a baseball bat at Dodger Stadium? This ball is crushed. On Ben Scully Way? It's time. It's time for Dodger Baseball. Oh, rest in peace, Ben. We miss you. Dodger dog, no cheesesteak. Yeah. Yeah, the, I heard, well, I know the Dodger dog's different now. Are these fools over there taking selfies? Are, are you fucking kidding me right now? Let's get this going. Like, for real, you need to have that in the, in the work. Oh, man, I almost, oh, man, I knew we almost died up there. Fuck, I was scared for my life the whole time, except for the second I stopped to take a selfie with my homie. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, shit, yeah. Where are we living, ladies and gentlemen? And you say to yourself, you've been up there for, God, a goddamn hour. Don't you think you would have done that, I guess, before the helicopter showed up and everything else? that point you would have took a quick you know quick one you know you said fuck we, we, we survived this fucked up part is they're doing that shit and all of a sudden <laughs> well you're already fuck here. you kdl <laughs> i know you heard that <laughs> i know you heard that look at her she's looking back like who said that <laughs> She's giving him the evil eye. Consulate General of Mexico in Los Angeles. We are very I, grateful. I'm, I'm sorry, to... sir. I'm sorry. Excuse me. No worries. Whoever's no worries. shouting out, I want them removed right now. They're violating Rule 12 <laughs> of the council. They're to be removed from the council. They're going to be subject to Rule 7 as well. Leave the meeting. Leave silently. You're ordered removed. Leave silently and immediately. Who is this? Mr. Herman? 
Sir, sit down. You're blocking people's views. <laughs> Look, he's already pissed. Look at him. He's already fucking shit faced. And he ain't even talked to the public yet. <laughs> he hasn't even seen anybody from the public yet. More problems as you keep being seen throughout the city. So stop listening. For the love of God, y'all are not helping. Y'all are making things worse. And Paul Krikorius, eat shit. <laughs> Paul Gregory needs some shit. Here's a sandwich for you. Take a big bite. That, that would spur the economy because then you'd go spend money. They didn't do that. Gangster needs his cut. So it sounds like we got us a fake cop with a rolling around with a gun when out of his window with LAPD markings on his shit. As a progressive, right? Then I say to you, look at the dog taking a shit over there. Holy shit! Look at the dog. Look at the dog. Look at the dog. Is he taking a shit? Oh my god, the dog's taking a dude. What the dog doing? <laughs> I did. He took his shit. She just picked it up. <laughs> oh! At least she picked the log up. Ah, <laughs> oh, he was taking a shit, Bill. Good weight, right on the cobbles. <laughs> He's like, oh, yeah, I feel 10 pounds lighter. <laughs> flip it, you flip it, Pluto. <laughs> That's too funny. At least she's a responsible dog owner and picked it up. I want to say, shout out to the dog for pooping on the stream. <laughs> oh, shit, yeah, man. Enough watching this shit. We got plenty to do tonight. Are those the Hollywood? Riders protesting, they should stay on strike because their fucking work sucks dick. <laughs> I mean, I'm always telling you guys how unoriginal you motherfuckers are. We don't need another fucking remake of, you know, trading places or whatever the fuck you come up with tomorrow. We don't need that. We don't need it. Stay the fuck on strike, you unoriginal motherfuckers. Hopefully, you know, you'll get some unemployment. Hopefully, you don't. Maybe you'll become original and start writing. Yeah, I don't even know how to open that setting. Motherfucker, get you locked the customer in. <laughs> Last time he comes in there, so they locked him in. If you buy nothing, man, fuck him. He didn't want nothing. Fuck him. You locked him in there. <laughs> oh, it's like that one time I've seen the cops. This girl, this little lady, she was transient. She went, went to the bank. She went to use the bathroom, she said, and then she fell asleep when she was in the bathroom. So she says. And then she woke up and everything was closed. Look at that! Sandrail, look at that thing! Dang. That thing is straight party, dog. Look at that thing. Hour straight, and we've had eight car crashes already. Eight. <laughs> comes another one. Of course it was the Mustang driver who got his shit stuck on the tracks. Forty pounds, I gotta tell you Mike, my friend Stefan's cat there was a cat named DB next to him, and that cat's got to be 30 pounds. Easy. Easy. 
Ship up right now, too great. In Beverly Hills. Beverly Hills. I used to work right here, right in the street. So he locked himself in his trunk? Or somebody locked him in the trunk and forgot to feel the fucking phone that was in his pocket. I mean, I don't know. Like, what? And so many questions. So many questions. How do you get locked? How do you get locked in your own trunk, guys? How many times has that happened to you? I mean, it's happened to me at least six, seven, I think, in my lifetime. <laughs> I don't know. What do you guys think? Oh yeah, man, it's crazy. Last night I got myself locked in my own trunk. Like locked out of your house, I get. I think everybody's done that one time. You know it's true. The victim The victim jumped in the bed of the truck. Maybe they were running away from their their captor. They jumped into the, the truck. Possible victim in the cab just broke out the window to the pickup truck. <laughs> trying to assault the driver. <laughs> Crazy. happening within the cab fucking someone calling from the bed so maybe they kidnapped that person through him and I bet you it's like a boyfriend in, through the girlfriend in the cab family member saw it jumped in the truck called from the bed bet that's what's happening something like that they're trying to protect their family member their you know, sister or brother retired from football became like a paramedic and forget how he died man I think maybe rock climbing with his friends or something. Oh, damn, oh, he put his bike down. Oh, he put his bike down. Holy shit. Holy shit, he just dropped his bike. <laughs> oh, that's never good, Billy. That's never good to drop your big ass bike on the side. Oh, boy, that thing's so heavy. You drop it on the side, something's bent. The kickstand, the peg, something. <laughs> Scraped up the. The saddle there on the side, I'm sure he's gonna go take it around the corner and look at it. He's fucking feeling fucking stupid right now with all the lights on. Him. <laughs> Why are you watching? Yeah, girl. He's having fun. Oh, he tried to get the kiss. Nope. <laughs> oh, he went in for the kiss and it was denied. <laughs> Oh, uh, shit, yeah. Shit, yeah. Oh. Set it up like the power play. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he passed, guys. Thank Thank you for 10, 390. He's, he's dead. Ah, rest in peace, dude. Fuck. He was killed. Uh, what happened with car versus pedestrian? This person... Evidently, must have struck this individual crossing the street, and they're now deceased. That's why I say viewers' discretion is advised, ladies and gentlemen. Now you'll have to wait for the coroner to come out, and 
Uh, I'm assuming CHP would come out too, because it's a fatality wreck. Yeah, I like parks. Uh, those, those are real nice. Um, it'd be nice if they had a place to uh, take their dogs to shit, so they're not just shitting on the sidewalk. I know that could be kind of a bad thing, even over there, but underneath the bridges are the nice places for parks, where there's a little shade and stuff, maybe some trees. Uh, 1341 North Seaward. Uh, I, I don't know about the address. Uh, I'm a little concerned about... You can talk about it in general if you want to go to general. So let's, 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 let's stick with the items. Off <laughs> warning. That's battery. 24 on CDU. Yes, sir. Smells of fabric. Really? Yeah. Let's remember, punk died with Sid Vicious. On uh, number one, while we're renaming streets, I would like to see a block of Figueroa renamed Smoke and Scan Boulevard. Uh, KDL, stay strong, man. That if these people haven't figured out that the grift is that you guys are all hanging together and aren't going to do anything to hurt anybody else and they won't vote for somebody else, eh, it's their fault for uh, staying with you. That's it. There's KDL eating chips, listening to the comments like, hell yeah, bro. <laughs> Shout out to Brock Panders. Well, there goes, goes my hero. Mr. Harland, you are disrupting Go the crazy. meeting. You're going to get kicked Please. out if you don't be quiet. Stop, Victor. Mr. Harland. We're going to close session now anyway, but but you need you need to leave because you're right. yelling. You've please been ordered. Re please remove Mr. Harlan. You've been ordered. <laughs> remove Mr. Harlan. Please. Go remove. crazy, Mr. Harlan. Uh, okay. Well, and, and now we have to clear the room officially as a closed session. Right. City attorney. You want to rape white yeah, people? So we are ready to. <laughs> well, as soon as we clear the room, we can go into closed session. Love you, Mr. Mr. Harlan. Harlan is still disrupting the meeting. He's my hero. <laughs> Registered sex offender property. Ah. Mr. Harlan, please be quiet. Just leave. Mr. Harlan has been asked to leave. Okay. So you for the record, so we're going to the closed session <laughs> to hear David Kagan v. City, which is Supreme Court, uh, U.S. Supreme Court case number 22-739. Um, that's not. Just pay the bills on number nine. Why are you trying to make something out of there? Um, don't make. <laughs> oh, whatever. Don't let them transfer money. Don't let the mayor transfer money around, okay? That's not her money. She's trying to pay her guys and create all kinds of situations where she gets money. Don't let her transfer money out of the Bureau of Street Services either. Number 10. Yeah, it's exposed from the waist down. Go away, Baton. That's what I'm talking about. Quit playing with your dinghy. Oh shit, yeah. I've got a semi boater. And I'm wearing sweatpants. <laughs> you talking about that, you old <laughs> he's wearing a trench coat with a fanny pack, and he's he's naked from the waist down. <laughs> the puppets will believe everything's good and close. Three eleven woman. She wears underwear with big holes in them. <laughs> wow. We've got Bush. Hell, pie. She tested very high on the strokeability scale. What? So you, got a, you got a guy out there, you got a girl out Dude, it's, it's bone day. We got a pervert at the park? I am. No pervert. Go away, Baton. Quit playing with your dinghy. <laughs> That's two 311 guys and a 311 woman. What time is it? One o'clock? Before, eight minutes before one. 
boy, oh boy, it's like dick and clam day. Let's get it. <laughs> it's going to be a 311 night. Yeah, the guy at fucking Starbucks showing his cock? Where's Starbucks? Nice to meet you. <laughs> the Masturbation Network, keeping America baiting for 300 years. And now, Sweet Fang Tube. I've got a semi boner, and I'm wearing sweatpants. I am no pervert. They've got three 311 men and one woman before one o'clock. That's four. So we're definitely going to be doing, okay? We're going to be doing something extra for 311s tonight. Don't ask what the call is tonight. Know what the call is tonight. Okay? We're already getting our hint. People walking around naked. It's warming up, you know? You can see it's hot. Summertime, look, people's hot, you know? This is what it is here in California. That's sunny California right he's zooming now. zooming in on Pinky right here. Look, let's see if he zooms in on the pink chick. That he does. He's already kind of big. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why is he keeping her in frame? Why is he keeping her in frame? Why is he keeping her in frame? <laughs> Trust me, it ain't just some old. Somebody's using this robot cam. Shout out to you. How come? How come? Next, so get yourself a few extra followers. So.